It's spring, so that means it's time for more gross Oreo flavors, but this year's gross Oreo flavor comes with an extra issue uh, that is sticking around for a long time with the people who are eating them. So um, we've seen other flavors like Swedish Fish, Fruit Punch, Banana Split, um, Triple Double Neapolitan Crunch. I don't remember the name, but you, you can look it up. It's close to that, three layers. Uh, too many flavors. This year we have Peeps Oreos. Peeps being the marshmallow uh, chicks and bunnies that come out every Easter and now also every other holiday for some reason. Um, so people are eating these, but they are posting their issues about them. One in particular food blogger junk food guy gave a stern warning saying, dude, the cream turned my saliva bright pink, bright pink. This is sort of horrifying. This is the type of food dye where an hour later, when I went to brush my teeth, it turned my toothbrush pink. What the heck? What the heck? Uh, and then other people were sharing their issues on, on Twitter. Uh, JD says, the thing that disturbs me most about Peeps Oreos is that I woke up with a tongue the same color as the cream filling. And what's more, it's going beyond the tongue and the toothbrush. It is going to the butts, uh, according to these tweets. Peep Oreos colored their poop pink. Guys, I ate a whole package of Peeps Oreos today and my poop is pink. <laughs> my roommate ate a whole pack of Oreo Peeps and left a pink stain in the toilet. And at Oreo, the Peeps Oreos made my poop bright pink. Um, and this happens, this may remind you of an old nerd alert story that happened uh, decades ago when they introduced Frankenberry in which kids ate the cereal and their poop turned pink and their parents freaked out, brought them to the hospital and continued to feed them the pink cereal. Uh, this is due in part to uh, F, D and C, red number three. And this is what a um, communications manager regard, uh, connected to Oreo told BuzzFeed. Certain foods can temporarily color the tongues and inside of the mouth. This is common with brightly colored products such as ice pops, gelatins, and drink mixes as well as certain fruits and vegetables, including beets and cranberries. What about poop, Kimberly? And also, no one asked about beets and cranberries. You were just adding that to make it sound like it was more of a natural occurrence to happen. Um, yeah, it's uh, food dye number three, which was also related to the pink poop incident of the 1960s and 70s uh, with the Frankenberry issue. They also had red dyes number three and number two. Uh, however, two was banned in the US after 1976 because it was tenuously linked to cancer in rats. But number three, uh, which was in that is still in use today and it's still coloring poop pink. So if you have a few hours to kill and don't care about nutrition too much, why don't you try this as an experiment? Uh, that sounds like I'm endorsing it, I'm kind of not. Uh, audience, have you ever eaten anything that turned anything on your body a different color than it should be? Let us know below in the comments and please like and subscribe for more.